Hi, it's me, Heidi. This is Steve. He's very unhappy because he's shy. But he's going to help me with my video. Yay! So today's Wednesday, and I'm going over the last two body shapes. Yay! And then next week, I'm going to go over all of them and how to dress and accessorize. Sorry, my voice is still a little gone. It's a lot better, but I've had it go away for like five days. So bear with me. I hope you can understand the things that I have to say. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. So first, we're going to go over the oval frame. And oval frame means... Um, just a little rounded, you tend to carry all your weight up top and everywhere, bust, hips, torso. Um, so the idea is nothing tight. You don't want to wear anything tight. Don't tuck anything in because that's not flattering. Um, vertical lines on top. Don't mess with horizontal. We want to keep the eye coming in and create a different shape. Avoid belts because those are also not flattering. Um, unless you really need one, you know, um, to keep your pants up, that might be good. Um, but as far as like waist belts or any sort of attention drawn to the middle should be avoided. And tops over tapered pants and or tights or leggings is great. Um, Ah, my voice. You should wear dropped waistline dresses, which means um, don't wear empire waist, like um, a dress that completely flows out from right under the bust, because that's going to give the opposite effect of what you want. So then we're going to move on to the slim eight frame, which I'm still confused about this one because I thought I was an A-frame and now I'm wondering if I'm a slim eight-frame. I'm not sure. So I'll have to consult the internet and figure that out. Um, so the slim eight-frame is just like a regular eight-frame, whereas the shoulders and hips are the same width and then the waist is smaller. Um, but the difference between those is the bust is a lot smaller, so it's a little bit less of a full figure, like probably not as curvy as an, a full frame, eight frame. So I don't know if that makes sense. So whereas I told you last time that a full figure eight frame should not wear embellishments up top, um, that the rules have changed for the slim eight frame. So if you are not very busty and would like to look bustier, you can wear embellishments up top, like pockets on the bust and, you know, like ruffles or whatever is your style. Like don't go out of the box here, um, as far as what you're comfortable with. Um, so that's pretty much it for 8-frame. Pretty much all the same rules apply, except there's a few extras, like being able to do different things. So yay, that's it for Slim 8 and Oval Frame.